Hello my seekers, welcome back. Welcome back to the channel. It's always such a blessing to have you right back here. Today's reading is for my Aries. Aries, you know that you're a diamond, right? Please go ahead and shine bright. Like the diamond that you are. Also, please make a note that if this reading does not resonate to your present situation, please do not get hurt, offended, or in your feelings. It only simply means that this one is not for you, but if you come back a different day, I might have one just for you, okay? Also, if it's your first time here and you have not yet subscribed to my channel, feel free to subscribe because it's free too, okay? And turn on your post notifications so that way you will always be reminded whenever I upload brand new contents. Also, all right? For my returning seekers, please know that I love you guys so, so, so much. Thank you for all your love and support. I see the love and trust me, I'm bracing all that good love. All that good love. I love you guys. All right, don't forget to thumbs up the videos also because when you thumbs up the videos, YouTube will see that you like the videos and they will push the videos out into a much wider audience and the channel and that particular video will grow, okay? So please um, show your girls some love and let's get these videos out there, all right? All right, um, please know that the card has been shuffled and the card has also been blessed. However, before I get into all my readings, I always have to pray first. Asking the Lord that to send his most powerful angels to take charge over this reading and just to give me the right words. Ooh, the right words and the messages that they want me to share with you, the seekers, only for the ones that need some, okay? So, let's pray. Heavenly Father, as I go along my day, I ask that you bless myself and my seekers. Heavenly Father, please send on your most powerful angels to take charge over this reading. Using my body as a vessel, giving me the right words and the messages that you want me to share with the seekers, only for the ones that needs to know. Heavenly Father, I give you all the honor and all the praises in Jesus' name. We pray. Amen. Okay, my darlings, let's get right into your reading. Um, please uh please follow me on um Instagram, okay? Um, for some of you, you might need to send me a personal message. So go ahead and connect there. I did make a uh Instagram page just for all my seekers. Okay, so go ahead and follow me on Instagram. That way you will reach me uh, much faster there, okay? And I do have a playlist, so go ahead and check the playlist if this one does not work. If this reading is, does not connect with you, all right? So let's get to work, angels. Let's get to work. Let's see what the angels are saying here. Okay. Oh, someone seems surprised, okay? Oh, my God. The truth is, I'm obsessed. I really want the happy ending, is what someone is saying there. They're saying that they want the happy ending with you, okay? They want the happy ending. They want to be happy. They want um, the picket fence. They want the children running around. They want the, the stars, the universe, okay? Um, this is what... Someone is saying here, they want the happy ending. Okay. What is blocking that? I'm working on earning your trust back. Okay. So that's what's um, blocking the happy ending here. Someone, um, trust has been broken. Okay. With this situation here, trust has been lost. Someone's saying that they are working on earning your trust back. I'm coming back to you. They're saying that they're coming back to you, but they know that they have to earn your trust back. Trust was broken, okay? Trust was lost, okay? So now we know what caused that, okay? Um, true love is, is what I need to give, but I'm so afraid. So your person is saying that they know that um, they need to give true love to you. True love is what they need to give to you, is what is needed to make this relationship work, all right? But they've said that they're afraid to open up and to give you that true love that you yearn and that you seek and that what they need as well. I feel like your person has been hurt before given this true love. Maybe they have been kind of damaged. I feel like you and a person also have issues as well, going back and forth, trying to see eye to eye, okay? Um... And you, someone is kind of holding back here, okay? Holding back. Your person is holding back from having a second broken heart. I feel like your person did um, have a bad case of broken heart in the past. 
And with that broken heart comes them doing things, not really giving 100% of themselves to anyone since then. Okay? Also putting a damper on that trust thing. Do you really want to know the truth is what they're saying here. Your person's saying, do you really want to know the truth? I see like maybe you'll be asking your person for the truth. Just be honest. Just tell me the truth. Just tell me the truth. Just be honest. Your person's saying, do you really want to know the truth? Because I know I'm working on my trust. I know I have to earn trust with you, okay? In order for me to be open to you, I have to be able to tell you the truth, to relay the truth to you. But are you ready to hear it is what they're saying here, okay? Are you really ready to hear the truth? Can you handle it? It is the saying, my love is ready to receive true love, all right? They're ready to receive that true love. I've been lost for so long. Okay, so yeah, your person's been lost for a very, very long time. Um, Rather, let's just say damage to the point of almost no return. Um, see when you when your person met you, it took them by surprise because they never in a million years ever knew that they would have fallen in love this hard with anyone ever again because it definitely was broken before. Broken, okay, broken big time. They didn't let their guards down in the past, and that person really took disadvantage of their heart, and they're having a hard time trusting anyone anymore. Okay, anyone. Anymore, trust is like one of the hardest thing for them. But your person did um do some something that they shouldn't have done. Okay, okay, your person. I feel like out of not wanting to give a hundred percent of themselves, they did probably have some secret friends. All right, secret down low friends, and I feel like um that kind of hurt someone. That decision kind of hurt someone here. Okay? Judgment. Okay. Hmm. Um, I feel like this judgment here, a decision is going to have to be made, okay? A decision is after, um, a decision definitely is going to have to be made here. Real soon. Because someone is ready to move on and start something new. Okay? Someone is ready to move on and start something new. So, yeah, someone is going to have to make their mind up and come clean with the truth because um, someone is getting ready to set the plan in place here. I feel like someone is just ready to just um, say, listen, I'm about to go on a mission, okay? If you don't make this damn decision here, I'm about to put a plan in place. I'm about to take my ass with it somewhere else, all right? So I feel like the decision here is going to have to be made really, really soon. Because someone is ready to start something new, okay? Someone's ready to move on and start something new. For sure. Different. Period. Oh. The five of pentacles in reverse. Oh my goodness here. Mm-hmm. Oh my goodness. Mm-hmm. I feel for the situation here, um, your person doesn't really like to ask for help, all right? Um, for some of you, um, your person was like maybe feeling isolated at one point, but I feel like your person in reverse is like trying to pick the pieces up and trying to start mingling again, all right? I feel like maybe a person is not really taking this damn thing serious that you're ready to move on because somebody is definitely ready to move on and start a new, all right? Someone's ready to, to move on and start a new, but I feel like your person on the other hand is kind of in the slow lane here. Um, at one point, heartbroken, yes, struck really bad, but I think they're starting to have fun again and not really putting the most important thing um, into play, okay? Hmm. Oh, yes, honey. Mm-hmm. Knight of Swords, yes. You are ready. Mm-hmm. You are ready, honey. You are ready. Um, know that you're a very ambitious person. And when you set your mind to something, you get it. You you make a plan and you go for it, honey. Fast thinking. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Your person right now is not on this pace right here. 
because someone is ready to move on. Someone is ready to let go, let this go, all right? Someone is not ready, not, they're saying one thing. I feel the person is saying one thing, but kind of moving at a very slow pace. Um, maybe just having fun right now. That probably going out having fun and not really taking you serious. I feel like the person is not taking this as seriously as they should. Not. Mm -mm, they're not. They're moving really fast. Slow here. The person is moving at a very slow pace. Okay. Oh my goodness. Mm -mm. Oh my goodness. Um. I feel like with some of you, um, you have like anxiety and fear, um, to let let go of the past. All right, um, maybe for to seek help, but in reverse here, I feel like y'all just passed this. Okay, y'all just passed that. Y'all is ready, honey. Let me tell you something. Your person better get it together because you are ready to to move on. Okay, because you tired of being feeling anxious and 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 busting a sweat at night don't even know what direction your person is going and sitting there wondering what the hell is going on you ready to just let this oh uh, you ready to just move on let go okay you ready to roll because your person right here mm -mm, they're not ready i don't see um they said that they want to make amends and they want to talk things through but i don't see any fast movements here there's no fast movements coming in at all. Not for your person. Mm -mm. They're still lingering and dragging their feet. I mean, your person is saying that they want to come um, and, and tell you the truth about the situation at hand. But they're not coming in fast enough. I feel like they're lingering. Because they don't take, they're not taking you serious, okay? But it's not, you're going to need some, hmm, let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. You're just going to need to get some people in your corner, okay? And just to help you with this burden that you're feeling and this baggage and this load that you're carrying. Because I don't think your person is ever... I don't think your person is ever going to come clean about what the truth is, okay? I don't think they're ready for that. They're not ready for that. They're moving at a very slow pace, okay? Mm -mm. They're not ready for this. You just going to have to pick the pieces up and gather yourself together because you did experience a whole lot of different emotions from this breakup it's time that you get yourself together which i think you already have known that because the intuition probably already told you that your person is at a very slow pace right now so it's time that you keep it moving so that is your reading for today honey i hope it did resonate with you if it did please let me know i would love to see my heart emojis in the comment section all right and with that said, know that I love you guys. And always remember to pray, y'all, because prayer works all the time. And never forget to seek, and you will always find.